Hey everybody, Ray Diamond Sulo, you back again with another video. Today we're reacting to another Vid Chronicles video. Woman gets autistic girl fired. She instantly regrets it. This video was once again requested, guys. Let's get into it. Hello, I need to pick up my order. Hi, I'm Claire. How may I be of service today? You deaf? I just told you. Sorry. Can you repeat, please? I need to pick up my order. Okay, she don't. She don't have to talk like that and do all that mocking or whatever. Let me call someone. You can't just look it up in the database. I have shopped here for years. I know the owner. I only do transactions. I'm sorry. What? Are you slow or something? Hey, Claire, how are we doing? Tana, this girl is incompetent. I asked her to look up a simple order, and she needs a babysitter for everything. I was just trying to help her. This is fine. She's mean. It's fine. Come here. Look, I've known you since the store opened up. I value you as a customer and as a member of the board. But don't be bringing all that drama and all that rudeness to the company, all that negative energy. Hey, but Claire's autistic. And her family's powerful, okay? She chose to work here, of all places. So, could you just give her a chance? The love of my life Our and I are having our anniversary dinner tonight. I need my gift. Since when is having an autistic employee okay? And at the register, Dana? What were you thinking? I'm good with numbers. I'm not dumb, I'm good with numbers. Well, if you're good with numbers, then why can you look up an order number? Man, don't be rude to my staff, okay? Yeah, don't be Just rude. Calm it down. Dana, fire her. She does not uphold policy, and she doesn't have the skills to be an employee. Fire her right now! Maddie, this is unnecessary. I am on the board of directors, which keeps this place going, Dana. Fire her right now! Okay. Hey, Claire. Hi. Your shift's been over for a while, and I really appreciate you staying. Uh, unfortunately, as of today, I'm going to have to terminate your employment here. Okay? Really? You going to do that just because you know this customer for, like, since the store opened and you just going to listen to this customer like that? I'm really sorry. What did I do wrong? Please. You, I, didn't, I can fix it. Please don't fire me. I'm sorry. Look, I have plenty of other jobs, better jobs that I can refer you to, okay? R really, I'm, I'm sorry. Bye. Wow. Come on now. They could get in trouble for discrimination because that's basically discrimination right there. You know what I'm saying? Like, because if they were a, 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 a better functioning person, if they were a better functioning person, then you wouldn't have done that. But because she's autistic and you got the customer yelling at you, you're just going to fire her? Hey, 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 what, hey, what's the matter? What's the matter? What's the matter, sis? Sis. She can be fired. Fired? Who, who, what you mean? Lady in the store. Claire's baby? Hey, Maddie. <laughs> what bring you down here? That's a and, and, uh, oh, so she know him. Is that her? Is that, are they dating? Like, who is that to her? Her. Excuse she me? She gonna be fired and she gonna be dumb. Maddie? <laughs> Maddie did what? Clarence. How do you even know this joke? Joke? <laughs> this is my sister. The one that you caused to lose a job. Are you serious? Uh, uh, no. No, you I didn't know bad. you had a sister. This is all a misunderstanding. So nah, me... nah, nah. Keep that same energy. He, th this was meant to happen so that he could see the person she really is. Talk to Dana inside. We're done. What kind of human being belittles somebody because they have a disability? Babe. I can make this right. I'm sorry. I was here picking up your gift for our anniversary. I spent $2,000 on that gift, Clarence. And I don't care. You know what I want? I want you to stay away from me. You're not the person I thought you were. Yeah. It's a shame that Claire and I was actually going to pick out a perfect engagement ring for you. What? Babe, please. 
Like, why haven't she met your family and you talking about you about to pick out an engagement ring and she didn't even know your sister or who your sister was? I I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I should have never hurt your sister's feelings or got her fired. Look, I had a rough day. I was rushing. So you took it out and on irritated. her. I just wanted today to be perfect. You were sorry because you found out who my brother was. You horrible baby. Right. Let her know. You only sorry because you found out who her brother was. So you found out that she was the sister of the dude you dating. Like I said, stay away from me. We're done. <laughs> <laughs> you deserve it. <laughs> now, this is not a good time, Mike. I think you should make time for what I have to tell you. What? what is it? Dana sent an in store video of you disrespecting an autistic woman. Sir, I have. Yep, you about to get fired. I've had a trying day. I am apologizing. Apologizing won't make the issue less hurtful. I'm sorry, Maddie, but you're fired. Fired? Over this? Fires, please. Yeah. You made your bed, Maddie. That's how you treat now people. It. <laughs> you gotta watch how you treat. <laughs> Dang, she lost everything at once, man. This is this is teaching me how to beat, man. Cause I don't want to get get six be successful with money, uh, financially wise. You know, have money, nice houses, nice cars, and I don't want to be treating people like crap. So me watching these videos, like this, is showing me that people could really be like that. I'm not gonna be like that. I promise y'all. <laughs> It's hard to come face to face with your own wrongdoings. One mistake could cost you everything. Maddie's life went into chaos after ruining her relationship, reputation, and career yeah. by doing something so stupid. But it didn't have to end this way. Let's take a look at what could have happened had she made the right choices. You got this girl. Hello, I'm here to pick up an order. Hi, I'm Claire. How may I be in service today? Hi, Claire. I'm here to pick up an order. It's my anniversary. Well, I can't help you look up an order because I'm still training. Sure, no problem. Hey, Claire, how we doing? Hi. This nice lady is here to pick up an anniversary gift today. Hey, Maddie, it's great to see you. How you doing? Dana, you look handsome as always, and you know I had to stop by my favorite shop for such a grand occasion. <laughs> Of course, what's your order number? Order number 1057, please. 1057, I have it right here. Go. Thank you so much, Dana. You too, Claire. Hey, anything for my number one customer. In fact, I saw you spend over $2,000 here today. Next time you come in, I got a free necklace for you and a peek into the platinum room. The platinum room is for celebs Okay, only. yeah, that's what she would have got. really let me in? Uh, well, you're on the board of directors that literally runs this place. That's enough status for me. Thank you, Dana. You've really made my day. Anytime, Maddie. We'll see you soon, and I hope Clarence likes his gift. Clarence? I have a brother named Clarence. <laughs> Only if your last name is Underwood. That is my name. You're, you're the one that he's been going on and on about. Maddie, you're dating an Underwood? Don't be putting me on your blog, Dana. And Claire, yeah. it was really great to meet you. I'm sorry we hadn't met sooner. Clarence wanted us to make a year before we made the big announcement. That's okay. Something tells me you'll be sticking around. Hey, Claire, is that another ring? Shh. You'll ruin the surprise. Were you about to say ring, Dana? Matt. Hey, babe. What are you doing here? I was just picking up something. What are you doing here? I was picking up us. A... Picking me up. Yes, uh, don't tell me. She, she did a good cover right there, picking her working up. Working overtime at the last minute, especially on an important day as this. I know. Your girlfriend is super nice and pretty. 
Yes, I already know. And that's why I love you. And I love you too. Can we get our anniversary started now? Of course we can, but after I take Claire home. And also, I made some reservations at a very nice restaurant. And I got a surprise for you. Oh, I can't wait. <laughs> Come on, Claire. Now is not a good time. I think she about to get a promotion right here because they showing the good part, good stuff happening to her right here. I think you should make time for what I have to tell you. Maddie, I just saw Dana's blog and it says you're dating Clarence Underwood. That's huge news. Wow. They donate to our businesses every year and they're a powerful family inside elections. Dana wrote a blog? Yes, and it's a huge success. This is great news, and it could even get you in the chairman position. Chairman? Wow. We'll talk more tomorrow. Congrats on your anniversary. Now go enjoy. <laughs> blessings on blessings. Always be kind. The moral of the story is, just because someone is different, it doesn't mean they deserve to be disrespected. Yeah. You never know who someone knows or what they may be going through. So treat everyone with respect. Yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned. I'll be back with more videos and I'm out.